Warning, watching Snap Home Friday could cause the following. Increase in Snap Home Tool purchases. Drastic loss of toolbox space, possibly resulting in the need of a bigger toolbox. Feeling of personal pride and self-worth. Decreased communication with spouse or significant other. Lowered bank account balance. Tool envies from others, especially co-workers. Could cause a possible increase in libido and or increase in testosterone levels. Warnings have not been approved by FDA, FCC, EPA, FBI, FDIC, ASC, DOD, ICE, NATO, FTC, NCIS, or any of the other abbreviations that nobody understands anyway. Extreme caution is advised. Hello, YouTube boys and girls. This is Jason coming to you. It's Friday. It's Snap on Friday. Hamilton's out there in the truck. Let's see what he's got. Let's go. So man in the country that I know. No money in what he used to grow. No, he don't care what people think. When a farmer turns into a hippie, times a hard in Mississippi. That's the number one snap-on dealer in the United States right there. Y'all write that number there. Feels good in here. Yeah, Can you tell everybody what you're doing? We're building a 1978 Par X Ratchet. Sounds like you're on my one. Antique. Antique. I'm an antique too. Watch your eyeballs. Are you an antique? Yeah. I'm a Melbourne 25. <laughs> I feel like I'm CLU should be put out in the pasture. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. I feel like it should be put out in the pasture. Feels a lot better, right? Lot better. So I can yeah. toggle back and forth. I'm right there, it's pretty short. Yeah. Be good when you start running the wires and stuff up on the trucks or anything. Yeah. That's a pain in the butt holding them things. Yeah. That's magnetic. It's stick big frame to hold the wire and Let's look at that. Spring loaded. Much is better. Much is better. Can't buy the education over. Put the dog on mass. I ain't got a magnet on it, too, don't I? Farm fresh. <laughs> so these are, you got to be very cautious to turn them off. That's not running the batteries. Yeah, down. I always <laughs> turn mine off. Ain't nothing worse than getting a dead ratchet. <laughs> That's how I know people been in my toolbox, too. Most people leave them on. I always turn mine on. Because that way, what's the first thing you do when you if you're going to use a ratchet, more than likely you're going to use it in an off position, right? Yep, correct. Well, I ain't going to worry about it either. Clay, right there is what I was talking about on the Caterpillar. You bar and tow. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yep. I don't know if that's exactly what that one is. That is. Yeah. What's your thoughts? I, I think it feels pretty well. I would love it. <laughs> it is, isn't it? It's, it's back in business it again. Is, I like it. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Yeah. What kind of bargains you got today, Hamilton? Well, you already got the rats last the week. Yeah. We got the uh, buy one get one on the socket sets right here. 
the uh, semi deep quarter inch by them get the, the wobble not the wobble plus but it is the wobble though uh, on this deal 233 and the value on them is 143 and these getting them for free uh, there you go. Yep, yep, yep. Corpus We were in the slam of Corpus Christi. That's a bunch of them. No polishers today, do you? Right, right. About out of cordless stuff, ain't you? Best selling fire out of cordless stuff. Gas all liquid. Did you get your wife to do all that right? No. He did. He did it. Wow. All right, you got pretty handwriting. Right. <laughs> <laughs> got it. Gonna work. Come on, guys. We're gonna see if this will fit this injector line. Do a test real quick. Go around here. Y'all can see. Well, y'all can learn something. Be hung over. That part. Right, change the fuel filter on these. It's always a pain to ask the primer. And you can see right here, that's the injector line. We're going to see if this. Better in there. Yeah, it's This right here, and this one is more up to this one right here. How much is that? Is that perfect? All right, guys, let's fix our wrap this up on here and uh, show you what we got. All right, guys, y'all seen uh, we had a good bit of stuff going on the truck today, and boy, Hamilton's been selling the ratchets and the uh, air tools because they were slim pickings on there this week, or uh, also the 14 fours. So he's he's been moving some products. So let's run through what we got real quick. I got the uh, seven piece uh, four way angle head wrench set. This is the metric set or standard set, excuse me. It goes from three eighths up to three quarters. That part number is VS807, B as in boy. I got the metric set to go with it. And they go from 10 millimeter up to 17 millimeter. Um, as you guys seen that little segment where we tested it on the fuel line on the pack cars, and they work perfectly, so that's gonna come in handy. Uh, the next thing I bought is the high leverage pliers. That part number is HL138ACP. As you can see how they work, but they're supposed to be like four times the grip of a regular pair of pliers, so we'll be checking those out. That's the ones that they always advertise the penny pool test with, so that's pretty cool. And I got another light. This one's a rechargeable. It's got, um, flat side to it as well as the standard flashlight. That is E-C-A-R-B-0-4-2-G as in green. Um, it's 400 lumens on high, 100 lumens on low. It's supposed to run three hours on high, six hours on low. USB-C rechargeable, so that's gonna be pretty nice. Anyway, that's what I got today, guys. If you like this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. Subscribe down here below, and we will catch you guys next time. Y'all have a great one.